And good afternoon to our Emonious viewers. We are live here at the Dominica Table Tennis Association first calendar meetup for the year. We are here with Mr. Leta, who is the president of the Dominica Table Tennis Association. And we are at the Public Service Union where they are having again their first calendar meetup for the year. So, Mr. Leta, can you tell us a little bit about the Dominica Table Tennis Association? Can you tell us some of the benefits for the young people, especially to participate in this sport? And what is the requirement for membership in the Dominica Table Tennis Association? And can you tell us a little bit more about your meetups? For example, today we are here at the Public Service Union, the PSU building, which is opposite the gardens. So where exactly do you all intend to meet up during the time? Usually indoors or do you do outdoor tournaments as well? Okay. So you're catering to not just Rose and environs but also to other communities in Dominica. Okay, my bottom bottom. So as well, what can you tell us about the different games that are happening today? Well, what I can say, um, so far it's competitive. There's one guy who figures he's going to dominate the competition by playing him next. So I think he's going to be under the pressure. I won't call his name, but he's getting results. He's going to come. But we have, we now going into the quarterfinals. I think the top eight players are the ones in the quarterfinals. So I expect to have a very tough competition. Really not. Okay, so it is a bit noisy because you know we have the players doing their thing now. Um, but would you like to just feature what's going on? So we're just going to turn the camera. Okay, okay. So can you tell us a little bit about the different groups that are playing right now? Well, well, we just finished the wrong Robin. So we have the eight quarter finalists and we have the four quarter finalists in the women. So we, have, we took a little break, so they're just warming up now. Okay. But very soon we're going to start the quarter finals. And are you separating the groups based on male and female or age or what oh, is Oh yes, the... there's the males and there's female. So there are four semi-finalists um, semi for the females and we have eight quarter-finalists for the men. Okay. Is there any encouraging message that you'd like to share with young persons who are interested in participating in the Dominica Table Tennis Association or even older persons who recently, you know, discovered their love for it? Yes, I want to tell any, or any youngster who wants to come Come register with the Dominica Table Tennis Association. It's a very cheap spot to play. If you don't have a racket, 
we can try getting rackets for you all, balls, they're available. So just come down to the association or to the DOC building, register, and let's enjoy the sport of table tennis. Thank you so much, Mr. Leiter. No Lata. problem, Imo. So here we have the young persons who are participating in the different games. They're doing a game of round robin right now. And you can see they have some older, more seasoned players showing them how it's done. So for anybody who is interested in playing table tennis or joining the Dominica Table Tennis Association, you can reach out to any member of the executive as well as reach out to the Dominica Olympic Committee, the DOC, for more information. Membership is only $10 a year. As Mr. Later was saying, it is a relatively cheap sport to play and participate in. So if you know any young persons who are looking for a recreational sport, if maybe you're not the most physically inclined or active, but you want to get yourself a little more active, table tennis is a great place to start. Yeah, Imo, and one thing I forgot to say, man, you're talk talking about what is in it for the youngsters, I forgot to mention. Very soon we'll be going on tours, so once you can get up to Mark and you can make the team, you be can be touring the world with table tennis, you know? Caribbean, Cuba, Santo Domingo, United States, yeah, there are tours coming up, so once you can get on that national team, it travels. So the possibilities are endless with table tennis. Yes, yeah. It's a thriving sport and it's going to continue to It's thrive. going to continue, I can guarantee you that. Okay, that's great. And that is all we have today for our viewers. So if you're interested in finding out about the meetups for the Table Tennis Association, please reach out to, again, the DOC, as well as any member of the executive of the Dominica Table Tennis Association. We do wish our viewers continue to enjoy their day and we hope that you have a lovely rest of your weekend. Remember, admissions is $10 for the year. So don't be shy. Come on down, play some table tennis and have a good time. And look at the fun that the young people are having. So what do you do in the table? What do you say? Are you taking another board? Yeah. Thank you.